How's it? It's uh, Dustin Hunting NZ here, and we're on another mission, and we've got a fair bit of hunting to do. So it's Sunday at the moment, and we've, um, we're in Spot X till Thursday. Um, we've actually got two blocks to hunt, so both forestry blocks. It's pretty good hunting. All right, I'm uh, with Leo. How's it? Yep, and then where's Blake? Blake's on. Oh, <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> and this is Blake. How's it? Yeah, you've met him on... Uh, Many occasions. Many occasions, yeah, including trying to not get shot by Jed <laughs> um, in other videos. Sierra in Sierra's quarters, it's pretty flash as well. Fucking like five star. It is, it is. So yeah, we we're gonna head out for a little walk tonight, see if we can find any spots or even smack over a deer. But um, yeah, other than that, keep you fellas updated and uh, keep you guys updated on what the plan is. Yeah, same. So. <laughs> Alright, just better head off. Blake's got the gun this time, so sun's already going down. Just now see how far we can get. Got the uh, torch and a couple a couple of head torches, so Blake you shot yourself, what the f <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so um now hopefully we can spot saying or even uh, just find a couple spots for the morning. Uh, should be good. So his name is Bay Bungara on Barbie on the lawn and invited all their relatives from Megathera to come down. You're up first night, Sunday night. Um, just been chilling out and a few Dobros and um, other alcoholic beverages. <laughs> so uh, yeah, we had pork for dinner tonight, pork rice, uh, coleslaw and some, of course, brown onion gravy. And uh, yeah, just been chilling out, listening to a bit of Kevin Bloody Wilson, Clay Tool Stories. And now uh, we've just had some exciting news come through. Um, through our previous video, uh, Jed Baker, the feature, um, he was looking for a ball date, and he has now found his ball date. So yes, good on you, Jed. <laughs> <laughs> so yes, Jed is one lucky man. Can we confirm this, Blake? We can. <laughs> It is confirmed. <laughs> yeah, alrighty, it's uh, Monday morning. And, uh, yeah, weather's not too bad. Had a bit of rain overnight, but it uh, looks like it's going to hold off for a bit. So, nah, we're just going to head out now and see if we can smack over an animal or two. Yeah, so it's uh, quarter past eight now. Been walking for about an hour or so. And, um, you know, haven't spotted any deer yet. A few goats and whatnot hanging around. We've only seen one yearling print, so I think we're gonna head back, grab the quad, and then just boost up pretty much as far up this track we can get, or until we start seeing consistent deer sign. But, um, you know, it's cool scenery. A lot of clearings around, so fingers crossed. Nice, the yelling stag. Yeah, that is. The spook and shoot is a bloody good idea, actually. Yeah. Well, at least we know there's some here. Yeah. All right, All right. Ten o'clock now. Made it back. Did a bit of a loop there, so um, no, didn't didn't end up seeing any more deer. Uh, just the hind and the yelling there. So now we'll probably cook up a feed and then make a plan of attack for uh, later on the sabo. Sweet. Yeah, we've had a feed, uh, bacon eggs, got a five star gourmet meal. Old Chef Leo, you know, pretty good cook, pretty good cook. So, um, yeah, we're gonna head out now, different spot. We're gonna go across the other side of the road here. It's uh, some new pines. And then, yeah, hopefully we can nail something this time. Or at least see something with antlers. So now, nah. yep, hopefully, we, uh, hopefully all goes well. I guess here's the sheriff's quarters. Blake's got the old couch set up there. I'm a legend. Got your gloves on, mate. Oh, 
I'm driving, okay? Oh, yeah, the fair sun enough. The <laughs> Yep. Leo's bed. My bed. They spooned last night. She gets nice and uh, cosy in here, eh, Leo? Oh, you wouldn't believe it. <laughs> I did. I heard you. Here's where all the cooking goes on. Put a cleaning suit. It's alright. Sweet, off we go. <laughs> You're fing set to drive. Just park the bike up. Find a real nice spot, so we're gonna walk for a bit from here. Let's see if we can spot anything. Sign around, so it's looking good. Heaps of big shit. A little bit of routine as well. So, yep, yeah, we're onto the pigs now for a bit. At least the stag jumps out. Alright, there's a deer. Look like a hind. Oh, right there. So they must have been on the track. There's prints all down here. So we'd come from, we'd come from there. So they must have heard us. She's a good print here. It could be a stag. But we saw the mob run off. Couldn't see any stags. So um, I think what we're gonna do, wind's good. So we're gonna head up this ridge, follow that ridge and hopefully walk on top of them there and Smack over a spike or a stag if there's one there. Oh, yeah. You're good. How do you do it? Old pro driver, eh? <laughs> Four and a half stars. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh well, had no luck on those that mob that we're going for. I think they got a bit of a head start, so now we're just going on a bit of a mission still. Yeah. Trying to find some bloody stags. So we haven't seen a stag. Anyway. Well, it's three star ride. Right. Yeah, yeah. It's going down. <laughs> Spiker. Shoot them. Two spikers. Shoot them when you're ready. Wait, come up, come up. Rest on the rest on the fence. Safety here. Yeah. Just wait. Can you see the other one? Yeah. yeah. Wait, count, uh, count down when you're ready to shoot. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. You you shot where we Just shoot in the chest. Oh, right in the chest there. Oh fuck. How light's your trigger? Pretty light. Where'd they go? Oh, that was a bit of a bugger. So there's um, two tracks to choose from and Blake said, oh, what, what track do you want to take? And Leo goes, oh, hold on, we'll, we'll check, see what this track, where this goes to. And then sure enough, we um, poke a head over the corner and there's two spikers looking at us. Oh, probably 20, 30 metres away. So um, yeah, we tried to line them up and whatnot, but couldn't quite get them through the sights in time and they buggered off. So now it's a bit of a bugger, but at least we've seen some, some animals with antlers, so yeah. It's promising. So now ho hopefully we can uh, nail a couple soon. Sweet. 
I'll be your paparazzi, don't worry. Oh, sweet. Oh, shit. You ready? It's 20 past 6, and we're going to head off for a spotlight. <laughs> See ya. Hopefully we can nail something. We uh, know a couple extra spots now to look. In hopes of uh, finding ourselves a couple stags to get on the deck. So now, chances should be a bit better in the, in the night time with the old spotlight. Bit dumber as well. Might give us a little bit longer to, uh, to aim up and shoot. He's the driver. Pretty shit driver. <laughs> well, anyway. Star ratings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. True. Uh, yeah, so anyway, we'll uh, get a move on. Probably won't record, um, I probably won't be able to record the shot, but you'll get to see the uh, aftermath, uh, hopefully, of World War Three. So yeah. So It's not going to take that many sh Put on. Yeah, I just a hind and a fawn at the moment. They don't look too worried. Yeah, update. It's uh, two o'clock in the morning, and we've made it back to the shearers' quarters a little bit later than expected. And uh, yeah, we're still empty-handed, so it's not looking too flash at the moment. So um, yeah, I've got myself a dobro, two thirty in the morning to. Can drown in me sorrows, so <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> oh shit. Oh, is there more? No. Yes. What the f <laughs> As you can see, we've gotten a bit bored. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, um, not only are we empty handed at the moment, we've almost run out of petrol in our quad bikes. So we might have to do a trip into town. Anyway, it's the only thing keeping me pretty happy at the moment. Dobro. I could still got bloody um, wood chips in the sleeping bag. <laughs> <laughs> I can just feel it. How's it going? It's uh, Tuesday morning, and um, <clears throat> after a bit of a late night last night, we have decided to have a wee bit of a sleep in. Um, so it is mid morning now, and yeah, we're just going to head out for a bit of a mission. Gonna do a bit more walking today, um, walking off the tracks and whatnot. We just gotta, we just gotta shoot a stag. So yeah, we'll see what we can find. Um, anything with antlers is gonna get shot because we need the stag at least one. So yeah, I think we might even split up. So we'll do a bit of a split up, and then um, someone will go one way, and then the other two will go the other way. So yeah. Oh well. Keep you guys updated nonetheless. Hopefully all goes well. Yeah, this is the we are hunting for the big four hunting competition as well. So we've got the other fella, he's got ourselves a oh he's got us a pheasant. And um, hopefully a pig by tomorrow hopefully a pig tomorrow. Um, if not, hopefully we can walk into a boar or something like that and we'll smack it over anyway. Um, so we're actually hunting till Hopefully Thursday. Um, hopefully all goes well by then, and we've nailed a couple of stags. And then um, Thursday night, Friday, uh, trout fishing. So yeah, bit of a setup. That's why we need to get our stag because it is for a hunting comp. So yep, serious stuff now. Positive, the sun's out. 
finally. But it's um, <laughs> yeah, finally, but it's right when we're going into town, so hopefully it stays out and it brings these deer into the uh, clearings or into some open stuff where we can shoot shoot them. Yeah, so we're um, come cruising down the hill and the quad was turned off. We're just the neutral rolling down and um, sure enough, a mob of pigs 10, 15 metres off the track there. Um, could have shot a couple, but we're going for average, trying to get an average weight, and they look, just look like a bunch of little 40, 60 pound nice eaters. Couldn't see any decent boars anyway, so we left them. We got some deer to chase up the hill as well. So. Sweet. Anyway, we've come back from our um, afternoon hunt. Still um, dealers. Well, at least it's not dickless. And we've got Blake cooking for the first time ever, so cooking less. Um, hopefully, we can get out for a spotlight tonight. But with his, with his cooking, we might be poisoned. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's only Patty, so. <laughs> Pretty sweet. I'm not that much of a downsaker shit. I mean, <laughs> hey, I'm not Jed. <laughs> hey, <boy. laughs> oh, Ranger. Ranger only knows how to cook toast. <laughs> and he finds that a fucking mission as it is. Yeah. Fuck, Jed does. Hey, PG, actually, people. Alright. Oh, Penis. It's Jed it's does it. home ec. Does he? Yeah, and he still doesn't know how to cook. <laughs> I could rip it's, it on Jed. Rip on Jed two episodes in a row. <laughs> oh yeah, the old man's coming tomorrow, so... Yeah. Guess who's cooking tomorrow? We might not even have to shoot any trout. Um, shoot any trout? <laughs> Mate, if you're shooting trout, I'm coming. That sounds amazing. <laughs> yeah. My, um... Our fourth teammate. Caught two trout today, and he's on a mission to catch some more. So, you reckon we might not even have to go fishing? Oh, I don't. You reckon but it's not exactly hot enough? Oh, hold on, close up, close up. You want a turkey slap? He didn't do that, by the way. It's a bit of a miss for him. <laughs> oh, well done. I got it on the pan. All right, good update. <laughs> We'll be back for the next update. I Hopefully. <laughs> oh yeah. Update. <laughs> We've oh, hold on. <laughs> Jesus Christ. The update. Oh, We've had an injury. Mm -hmm. oh. We've had an injury. Oh. A patty was launched oh, easy, and sprayed up the wall oh, and sprayed on someone else. What? <laughs> Someone else? Not that we're naming any parties involved. <laughs> yeah. But it wasn't me and Joel. <laughs> yeah, outside. Yeah, outside Joel. So yeah, anyway, we've got injuries now. Serious stuff. Cooking with a bus. And yeah. It was almost a fatality. Just spotted a couple stags. One looks like a bloody ripper. The other one, maybe a ten. So we're trying to stalk in on them. See how, see how close we can get. They're quite a while away. So. Fingers crossed. Yeah, they can smell us, I reckon. Huh? They can smell us. I think. Oh, well, I missed that. There must be a whole mob up there. Holy. Yeah, sweet. So we've um, nailed a 
interesting looking stag. Um, yeah, so what had happened is that we seen it from, I don't know, a couple hundred metres away and decided to put on the stalk. We had, shit, there would have been at least half a dozen, a lot of stags in there, all in this pine area. And um, so me and Blake lined up and took one each. This one dropped on the spot. The one that Blake shot ran over and so um, yeah, anyway, we'll gut this thing up, drag her down the hill and see if we can chuck her on the quad. There's a bit of weight behind it and there's a lot of mud stuck to it, which probably adds an extra 10 kilos. But uh, yeah, anyway, it's good stuff. We're on the deck. One down, how many to go? Yeah. Where'd you get it? Well, look at his asshole. <laughs> Update, we've uh, got the deer on the back, the big trophy, eight pointer. Nine actually. Nine pointer, whatever it is. Uh, it's a <laughs> shitter anyway. Hopefully we don't get laughed at too much when we take it to the hunting comp. Oh well, got it though. we're going to mission back, um, weigh it up, then the old man's coming in a few hours. But this is our last chance to hunt this side of the forestry block, so we're going to thrash it today and try and catch up with those, uh, so that, some other stags. Uh, yeah, hopefully nail a couple more. Sweet. All right. <laughs> Shoot your load. Nice.